Campaigners have said the Scottish government is engaging in fantasy and not reality. Fury has greeted SNP ministers living in a fantasy after the Nationalist Authority issued guidance to NHS Scotland claiming it's not just women who experience symptoms from the menopause. SNP leader Hamza Yousaf's party has ordered every health board in the country to implement the controversial guidance, warning, transgender, Non-binary and intersex employees may also experience menopause and menstrual health-related symptoms. The decree has been sent to local health bodies to steer them on how to help employees who might be suffering from symptoms of the hormonal change. But the SNP and Scotland's First Minister have come under fire from campaigners. Harry Potter author and women's rights and spaces advocate J.K. Rowling mocked a similar biological claim remarking on the wording people who menstruate, to which she tongue-in-cheekily responded, I'm sure there used to be a word for those people. Someone help me out. Wamban. Wimpund. Wamud. Commenting on this latest menopause guidance, Susan Smith, director of For Women Scotland, told the Mail on Sunday, once again, the truth is being twisted and contorted and the Scottish Government is trying to impose an anti-science ideology on the NHS. Clinicians must surely be aware that menopause is uniquely an experience belonging to the female sex. It is insulting and demeaning to women to pretend otherwise. It is laughable that the government thinks that there are NHS employees who have forgotten what their biological sex is. Moose Smith added the SNP and the NHS in Scotland should be engaging with reality, not 